All right, so I've been seeing more and more videos recently of these turbo tank cleaners and people using them to clean the sediment out of their water heater. So I decided to get one and cut open the side of this water heater to see what it does to the inside of the tank. On the other videos that I've seen of people using this product, there were multiple comments saying that the wire at the end of that turbo tank cleaner would break the element, break the dip tube, or break the anode rod inside the tank. I'm all about testing products and seeing how they work before commenting on them, so let's give this a try. The idea behind this product is that as you're flushing the tank, that wire is going to stir up any of the sediment and debris sitting on the bottom of the tank and flush that out as well. Being a plumber and knowing what's on the inside of these tanks, my concern would be the same as those comments that I mentioned before. So let's see what's going on on the inside of this tank while you're using this product. Of course, there's no water in here, so I'm not actually flushing anything out. I'm really just testing to see what that wire is going to be doing to the parts that are on the inside of the tank. Nothing broke during this test, however if this was my water heater, I probably wouldn't use this product because of the beating that it's putting on the parts inside this tank. Anyways, let me know what y'all think.